on my way. I'm late as usual. I'm about to get a session in with Vince and my other friend Jeff. And I'll catch you guys at the gym. Construction is so annoying. I think I talked about this in yesterday's vlog. It's honestly so frustrating. There's always construction around here in Wisconsin. And since like we have such like strong winters or cold winters I should say and hot summers, the roads are always like heaving and contracting. And that's why our roads are so crappy. Basically why we have more construction than like a lot of other states do. It's just annoying. Hope everyone is doing well. My name is Joe Inklum. Getting right to the first part, I am making this basically just simply because I see this so often at my gym. And the way I would explain lifting in tennis shoes or something with a rubber sole, um, especially on your squats and deadlifts, is it's almost like squatting and deadlifting on a trampoline or a mattress. And by this I mean starting with squats, you are not able to get the proper amount of force you are generating out of the hole of your squat if you are wearing a rubber sole shoe. And with this being said, being able to get the most stable positioning possible on a squat is almost optimal if you are trying to move the most amount of weight that you are possibly able to. Being that you are wearing a rubber sole shoe, first of all your stability is going to be off just simply because it is not a flat bottom and you are not going to be able to get the best and most stable position possible. Secondly, as I mentioned, when you come out of the hole, the force you're generating into the ground is being dispersed simply because the sole is rubber. If you're doing this on a deadlift, being that the sole is raised, even slightly, you're increasing the range of motion you are actually doing on the deadlift. So if you were to go barefoot or use a sole that is slightly smaller, you're going to then decrease that range of motion and make the movement actually easier. Um, as far as squats, if you are to go barefoot or use something like an Olympic shoe or even a Chuck Taylor or even a Jordan, something that is a very flat bottom that is firm, you're going to, able, you're going to be able to generate the full amount of force possible because the, um, the sole of the shoe isn't dispersing that force into the ground in a, um, basically in a, in a way that's not going to be most optimal for you guys. I can't tell you how amazing it felt when I first put on my Olympic shoes that are only $90. The Adidas power lifters are only $90 compared to like the Romelios or the Addy powers which are the more expensive Adidas shoes um, which are around $200. So if you're looking for something that has a stable bottom especially for squatting I wouldn't recommend even wearing squat shoes for um, deadlifts just simply because it is going to increase that range of motion. Um, but if you're looking for something like that I would definitely recommend the Addy power lifters. If you're looking for something that is a quick fix, guys, just go barefoot. Especially on deadlifts, I even deadlift barefoot most of the time, and I have Chuck Taylors, and I have all sorts of shoes, but being that the deadlift is um, the best and most optimal with the shortest range of motion, um, wearing no shoes gives me that. And um, as far as squats, you can squat barefoot. Um, also, I've seen people using Vans, um, Chuck Taylors, like I mentioned, or even Jordans. Um, something with a flat and very firm bottom is going to be the most optimal for squats, guys. So hopefully this video makes sense and hopefully you guys can take something away for this so that your next leg day, um, squats or deadlifts, is that much better. Hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Just going to leave you with some raw footage. Please feel free to email me if you're interested in some online coaching at joeginklum at gmail.com. It will also be listed at the end of the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this and have a great rest of your day or night or whenever you guys are watching this. Please like the video if you did enjoy it and subscribe to my channel for more uploads. Thank you again guys. Have a great day.